Looky here, looky here. We got a new red dog. These are the two new mamas that we just let out of the pen last week. So these are uh, the two I got, got from Addington. So look at that tiny little calf. That is so adorable. Exciting times. What's up? Just out here a few days later um, after we uh, saw that new calf and uh, just coming out to do a herd check on them. Uh, do some counts, make sure everyone is accounted for and uh, check on that little baby. All right, we got one, two, three, four. Look at those red dogs, not looking very red anymore. Five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Uh, oh, there's a bunch laying down in some really tall stuff, so. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and they're all kind of grouped together, so. These two ladies uh, right here, they like to hang out a lot together because uh, they came from the same herd. They're, those are the Topeka Mamas. And they're calves. Stinking cuties. And then here, next up, I think we got 48 Luna and Luna's Bull yearling. Hey, 48. Hey, buddy. How you doing? How you doing? Hi, Luna. Pretty girl. And then we got Maybell, her bull yearling. Actually, he'll be a yearling this month. He was born last September. Uh, we got Cece. 
Is that CC? Pretty sure it's CC. Yeah. Yeah, that's CC and her calf right back there. And then in front of her is one of the Addington cows that we picked up last weekend. And then there is the other Addington, Addington cow with the little calf, little red dog. Born, oh, four or five days ago. So, stinking adorable. Alright, and then we got five more, so that makes 19, I believe. It's kind of funny the areas they hit up for grass, but in kind of the west end, they really hit the west end up pretty hard. But look, that's thick grass right there, so these guys are doing good. And obviously they're not looking sick, they're not looking skinny, they're looking good and healthy. Billy has really put on some size this summer. I'm really happy with how Billy's looking. There's that little yearling bull I really like. Uh, man, he's a good looking yearling bull. Uh, his mama's Molly. She's the one that scares me, and she's a great looking cow. And then there's Billy and Tilly. <laughs> I know, I need a gimbal. Very, very rough, I know. Bumpy. I haven't showed the bison a whole lot lately, so I figured I'd come and do several minutes of video in the bison some storms south of us but they're not moving our way so unfortunately but thankful we have got close to an inch in the past week or so, so happy about that i know i always say that happy and thankful about that but i truly am all right i don't know exactly what kind of flowers these are but hey tilly really like these a lot usually uh, I think these may be what some people call Indian paintbrush but um, usually a lot heavier in the spring but this one decided to show up if this is boring to you I'm sorry I just really wanted to come see my bison today Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, perfect. 19 out here, and we got one, one pinned up, so. Typically, I don't like to have just one pinned up, but that's just how this, this one worked, so. How this, that calf is so stinking small, it's so cute. All right, well, it is Wednesday, so I'm gonna go help Hope get the girls ready. We're gonna go eat some dinner with her family and go to church services, so there we go. See y'all later. I have not seen this guy in a while. But here is our jackrabbit. Death, aren't you? Yeah, you are. All right, I'll let you hide. Yeah, buddy. How you doing? 
You want some food? You want some food, bud? All right, all right, all right. Today, I'm gonna be welding on the little extensions I need for uh, the hinges on our gates we got built. Uh, we had a bunch of heavy duty gates built. Uh, bison need heavy duty gates, that's, that's all there is to it. So, um, I'm gonna get the, uh, weld the extenders on it, just with some uh, uh, flat iron. Uh, yeah, we got weeds all over the place. It's a mess. Uh, we can't cut over here because we still have a bunch of equipment all in this stuff uh, to finish the, the system. So, uh, anyways, uh, you got some flat iron and uh, you'll cut it to length, you know, uh, with the torques. Um, I went with 3 8 thick just because, again, heavy duty. And uh, it just makes me feel a little bit more comfortable. Um, one of these gates is extremely heavy, so uh, you know that's that's four three eighths thick um, extenders off of that hinge that'll be welded onto the post. So uh, you know, just definitely provides some extra extra security there and strength. So uh, that's what I'm gonna be doing today. I uh, hope y'all uh, enjoyed the video. Um, I will just leave y'all to me working for a bit and, and, uh, yeah, sure appreciate everybody watching. Uh, we got some new products coming out soon. Um, as far as merchandise is concerned, uh, we are going to have a, a sweatshirt released coming out soon. We got a long sleeve shirt. Now uh, the sweatshirt is like a alternate logo thing. And then the sweatshirt is our original logo. I'm sorry. The sweatshirt is an alternate logo. The long sleeve shirt is a uh, is our original logo, uh, and then we got um, one style of new hats in. So uh, we'll I'll put that all up on the next video. We'll get it posted to our website, and if y'all want to uh, purchase some of that, you absolutely can. So all right, y'all have a great day. Thank you for supporting Bison and supporting Arrowhead Bison Ranch. See you later. I think I'm just gonna use that. Alright, 18 more to go. You know what? Let's do this an easier way. One, two, three!
Thank you.